Hello everyone, this is Cool Brown M5 and welcome to my unboxing video on Grand Theft Auto 5 Collector Edition for the PS3. Now, let's get on with it. Now, first starting off with like the appearance of the whole box and basically like the Collector Edition comes up in like a whole massive box like this and as you can see it's like even a big mark. Well not a big mark but like making like its own squared mark with dent on my, on the bed but yeah. Anyways, it has a really nice cover at the front and as you over here you see the sick GTA 5 logo and as you see around here like bits of scenery like the guy wearing a what you call it um but whatever I'm not gonna try and describe anything because yeah I want to play this game and it's it's so sick and the collector edition just features a lot of stuff which you're about to see well yeah a lot of well not maybe a lot of stuff maybe it's not a lot of stuff but um you know, anyways, now over here it's like a bag of money which looks sick. It suits the like the back of the, it suits like the back of the box over here. And as you can see, it just shows all the specs back here, as it does in any PS3 game. And yeah, one of the blatantly obvious things. And yeah, I've got it for PS3, mainly because I use my PS3 more than my Xbox 360, and more of, and more people that I know have a PS3 than an Xbox 360s, so I can play GTA Online with them. Which they've currently fixed, so so yeah. Now let's start unboxing the package. See what's inside. Oh, this is one big box. I mean, I'm holding the camera with one hand and I'm using the whole big box to hold like with the other. Like, I think my left hand is with the. Seriously, I'm gonna have to do it like this. It'd be so much easier if I had like a tripod on this, but on my phone, but my phone isn't exactly a video camera, but yeah. Anyways, I'm going to turn this upside down, and then slide it with my other hand. Now take a look at this. Now doesn't this look epic? It has like this nice design. It has like this nice kind of look for the GTA 5 logo, and you can actually like feel it as well. It just, it feels so good, like... <laughs> Yeah, don't mean to sound wrong, but yeah, it does. It just feels like it has like a really nice feel to it. It's some um, what do you call it, um, and yeah, basically, in my opinion, it looks like slightly better than that because it's like what's it called? It's like a logo that you can actually feel, and yeah. And under here, you see the Rockstar logo. Anyways, now let's get the box up. Now, for many, of, many of you who know like how to op how boxes of iPhones and iP iPads like open up and all that, it basically has like the similar. This box basically has that similar type of opening. So yeah, we can actually open it like this. And what? And basically, what's inside here is the. Now. We're gonna now, as you can see, there's nothing in here, but that's because it came from here, obviously. But yeah, now we're gonna take this, this out, which is what you're gonna see later on. Whoops. But yeah. Now, as you can see, it comes with the game over here, which is a nice steel box. It's got a nice steel case for the game, wrapped up in plastic, and basically like foam down here, which is, and it comes in like some sick kind of, what you call it, some sick kind of packaging with like the two V's over here, and yeah, basically the back just shows like a nice kind of design as well. So yeah, now we, yeah. So anyways, now what's included is the Los Santos cap and the. What's it called? A case for like the iPad, I believe. So anyways, and how we're, the way we're gonna open it is like from here because it has like an opening mechanism. So yeah, now basically we it has like this opening over here where you open this up and then you take out the case. And doesn't that look awesome? It's also got a nice G E A five logo as well and yeah apologies for a little bit of hiccups there but however this requires a key to actually open it but the key 
the key is not over here, but the key is like under this, but you'll see but you'll see the key when I when I actually get to unboxing this part anyways. I just wanna play this game because it looks because everyone's like talking about it and I know I've played I played it around Bandicoot 815's house and yeah, it's a really good game and I just can't actually install it even though it's gonna take ages to install. Anyways, now let's get out of the Los Santos cap. Look at how sick that is. Los Santos. I'm gonna wear it. <laughs> Anyways, now time for unboxing the Anyways, now we are gonna get this out of the Anyways, let's just get the game out of of this packaging and as you can see like underneath the game you have like you have the code which is part of the collector's edition pack. And over here and this code is obviously gonna be used anyway, so so what do you call it um so there's no point in you guys trying to you know use this video to cheat with the code. Anyways, let's take this out. And this is basically the huge poster that comes of it and it, I know it doesn't huge it obviously doesn't look huge because it's clearly folded up, so yeah. And here's the key I was talking about to the to this case right here. Here's the key. Which act, which actually looks really nice. It's got the Grand Theft Auto 5 logo on it. Which I personally like. It's awesome. And the Rockstar logo on the back. Now let's... Let me see if I can get out the package with just one hand. And here it is. The nice key that, you, that we're all looking at. The key of epicness. Made by Rockstar Games. <laughs> and... Basically, there's nothing inside here because, obviously, because it's like just the case alone. Now, anyways, now we are gonna get to um, to opening up the actual game itself. This, and it's not just, and instead of like an original packaging like like they'd sell like for an original PS3 game, it comes in like a nice steel but case, as I said earlier on. And at the back, you see like guys holding the guns and all that and. Don't really know all of their names, but yeah. Anyways, now I'm gonna try and open this up without the. Well, this, oh, this actually, this plastic actually feels hard. It feels harder than all the other plastic materials that I've opened up. So, yeah, just opening up my right hand here. Don't worry, I'm just doing my best. There, that's a bit of plastic taken off. Now, let's unseal this. Let's unseal this beast. It's the beast of epicness. That is GTA 5. Yeah, just it just felt right saying that, but yeah. I'm telling you, this is game of the year. I'm not even lying. I haven't even seen the disc of seen like the disc yet, but, but yeah, anyways, now here's the six steel steel book case. Feels quite hard because obviously cause it's a field case and yeah. <laughs> Didn't mean to sound wrong again saying that it feels quite hard, but yeah. Anyways, let's open this up. And here we have the actual disc. And yeah, it's a nice disc, in my opinion. Anyways, and hopefully in a lot of opinions as well. A lot of other people have the same opinion too. And I actually like this kind of packaging because it gives like the, what you call it, the, the, it gives it like a nice presentable look. And yeah, it's brilliant to have in a collection as well. And nah, they, and obviously the disc is going to be in sick, brilliant condition. But yeah. Now let's get, yeah. now what's included here is, Clearly, the manual and the and the map of the game, and at the back is just blank and just GTA Five logos like all the way over here. <laughs> now, anyways, and I really can't wait to play this game. It's gonna be epic. I know. I think I said this before, but yeah, it's yeah, it's gonna be sick to play this game. I'm telling you, and I know I've said this before. But this is game of the year, and 
a lot of people are saying that this is actually better than Call of Duty Ghosts, and that's not even out yet. I also can't wait to play this game, and also I'd like to... I'd like to announce that I officially have 600 subscribers, so yeah, this is basically a 600 subscriber subscribers special video from a special unboxing video. And also, I'd like to make a shout out to Abdul the Arabic guy, aka Crash Bandicoot 4616, because it. And it's not just any shout out for him, it's a birthday shout out for him, because. Why? Because it's his birthday tomorrow. Happy birthday, Abdul. And yeah, no race. By the way, no racism intended by saying Abdul the Arabic guy because apparently he didn't like he didn't like the name Crash Bandicoot four six one six anymore, so he changed it and wants to be known as Abdul the Arabic guy. So yeah, ask him. Now, anyways, that's basically this video done. So see you lot in another one of my videos. Later, everyone.